Hi, uh, my name is Christine Sharp. Usually I post videos of my choirs doing warm-ups, but I wanted to share something new with you. I do a lot of like brain break, getting to know you, team building stuff in my class, partially because I'm on a block schedule. So my classes are 82 minutes long, which is a lot of time to just sing, especially for eighth and ninth graders, which is what I teach. Um, so I've been trying to work with one of my choirs specifically more on just being kinder to each other, getting to know each other more. They've had sort of a rocky morale in that group. Um, so I've done things like the Chair of Positivity, which I stole that idea off of our choir director's uh, Facebook group. But then of course at like three o'clock in the morning, which is when I get all of my great ideas, I was like, oh my God, this would be such a good thing to do. So I tried it today and it worked really great. So I wanted to share with you guys right away because I think it's something that you might find useful. So what I decided to call this activity, you'll just need to give your kids like a piece of scrap paper. I just cut up some pieces and a pencil. And we did this the very first thing right off the bat and I call it compliment or confession. So basically what the kids do is they can write down an anonymous compliment to somebody in the group or they can do an anonymous confession of anything that's going on in their lives. And I stressed the importance of if they're going to write a compliment, try to make it a deep one. Don't just be like, you're pretty, you look good. Uh, try to dig a little deeper, make it really a genuine connection. And then I said, if you want to do like a really deep confession, like somebody in your life passed away, you can do that. You can go as deep as you want, or you can go not deep at all. Like it was really up to them what they wanted to share and what they felt comfortable sharing. Um, so we did that first thing in the morning. We collected all of them, put them in this envelope. And then after every song that we worked on, I would just pull a few and read them out loud to the class. And it kind of went amazing. Like they got so excited for it. They were like, oh, we get one now, we get one now. And like, as soon as, usually when we were going in between songs, it would be like, oh, well now they're just talking because we finished a song and they just turned and they're like, blah, blah, blah. but this time they were super focused and they were like, you know what? I want to know what the next person says in that envelope. Um, so it was really good for focusing, which I wasn't anticipating, but the things that they said really shocked me. Like we laughed, we cried, we bonded. It was really kind of amazing. I'll share some of the things that, that they shared with us. Um, and hopefully it's something that you can find useful in your group. So I'll kind of go back and forth between some compliments and some confessions. This one's a um, simple confession. It just says, I've been having a really bad month. Yeah. And I think it was something that a lot of kids in the group were like, I feel that. I feel that. Yeah. And they were all, they're all about that. Here's a compliment. I love this one. This says, I like how Shaylin is starting to get more confident with her voice and singing out. And everybody around here was like, yes, you are. You're singing so good. It's great. And it really is. She really has gotten a lot better. Um, this confession says, I have terrible anxiety and extremely low self-confidence. And I think that was another thing we could talk about. Like I do too. And I'm an adult and it's something that, you know, we work through and you'll get better at time. Um, this one made me cry. My kids already know I cry a ton all the time. Um, but it was really nice. So I wanted to share it too. It says, Miss Sharp, you probably don't know this, but I really love you and all the things you do for me. You've saved my life more than a few times, and I'm super thankful that you're in my life. P.S. Sorry if you cried a lot. I almost did writing this. Um, yeah, so I think I could go on and on about, like, how great it was um, for this activity, and I'm really excited to do it more often. Yeah, um, I could keep reading them because they're, they're lovely, but I think you get the idea. Um... I call it compliment or confession. I even drew like cute little like hearts and, and stars and stuff, you know, but that's the activity. And I think it's really good for bringing your kids together. So hope you enjoy and have a great day.